Love the I love the new room. It's so beautiful. Yes, <laughs> we're proud of the studio. It's very very nice. Safi is our game host. Bellagio and Anthony is our first dealer today. Anastasia, who you recognize as one of the great dealers here at the Lodge with the hockey sticks. The pride of Ukraine, Anastasia. Ooh. Oh, how about a boat for Lara? What a flop for the pocket fours there. And Amber with the flush draws. So this is going to be an interesting hand. Anastasia might peel here too with her sevens. She probably thinks she's good a lot of the time. Brick on the turn. See if Laura can extract some more value. Smart decision there for both players to let their hands go as they were drawing very, very thin. So uh, Laura takes down a nice spot. It's so, so yeah, just Pokemon with Christy and Kristen yeah, I played with. About that last time. The weightlessness. Yeah. Anastasia's like, dealt to me before, matter. I think. Yeah. Yes. Wait, you guys are heads up with the net button. Oh, shit. Down to the As you're becoming more and more popular in the poker world, do you find that you get recognized over and over? I do. I, I don't like it's You're still not used to it. No, it's <laughs> it is really like it's cool and um they like, pretty much anywhere I go and sit down someone will say something, which is a very cool feeling and yeah, it's nice. But it's also Poker. interesting. Yeah. Let's see this hand. Poker Mama with ace ten with the knit button. She's probably contemplating putting in a three bet here. She need to go a little bit large. I would love to see the three bet here, and she does. Good spot to do it too. Oh, I take that back. Christy wakes up with a monster, unfortunately. Big slick. <laughs> chip values: the thousand dollar chip. That yellow one is one thousand. Black chips one hundred. Green chips twenty five, and red chips are five dollars. You might see a purple chip out there. That's five hundred. See what she decides to do here. <laughs> I think he's promoting it. <laughs> Princess of Pip is in chat. She'll be playing tomorrow on the stream. The Princess of Pip making her return to the stream table. I like that name, Princess of Pip. That's poop. That's uh, Joe Strazera's lovely wife. Oh, okay. Very cool. Is she I don't contemplating? Feel like he liked this move, so I'm just gonna. Uh, okay, she does <sighs> want to call, but I think I'll leave it to you guys. Mm -hmm. So Poker Mama here with the aggression factor because Christy decides to just fly. <laughs> Amber gonna set mine here. This pot's big getting mom. big. Interesting spot here. <laughs> Like a commentator. <laughs> <laughs> the truth is, I watch Spraggy videos and it stuck in my head when he says the big pot. <laughs> if Poker Mama continues her aggression, okay, she decides to check. Interesting. Interesting spot for these players. Check. Spot checks. Okay, checks through. She's got to think that Christy has a pretty strong hand there. <laughs> you better stop. You better stop. <laughs> She's going to come to come in with a bigger sizing here, which I would love to see. It looks like she is good sizing. Nice hand. Nice, pl nice play here. Christy most likely going to let it go and 
We'll see how sticky Amber is. <laughs> yeah. Amber does have a straight draw and a pair. The thing is, is Poker Mama can be checking all of her strong hands out of position in that spot, so she still is actually uncapped, even though she checked flop. Can she get it through to let go of her knit button? <laughs> now Amber's kind of shown a little bit of weakness here with um, that posturing there. So I think she's going to end up letting it go here. Oh, big bet. Great bet size by Poker Mama. Well played. Gets the fold. Well, 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 well played. Show her hand. Well played. Let's go. Get rid of the knit button. And I believe Lara will be the one paying the tax, if I'm not mistaken. Beautifully played there by Poker Mama. Did you play PLO? I have before, but I didn't do it. Horrible. But I get so stuck there. And it's like you're never getting that back at hold them, you know? You go to hold them after that, and it's so slow. Yeah. I'm like, I Kristen puts in the three bets. The Jack Knight suited. This money. Lara wakes up with a pocket pair. Yeah, obviously, the tournament play you play this, right? But I'm saying I haven't played like actual cash. I try. I try to do it all. It is tough. I'm always so happy when it's like a bomb pot in the play. So you do like good pocket eights a hand that's kind of stuck in the middle. You don't want to fold. You don't want to. Ooh. How about a set for Laura? Really Just call and flop a set. <laughs> Kristen picking out, picking up some outs there. Plays really big here. The PLO. Oh yeah. Yeah. Have you played PLO? I don't, but I'd like to play. More. I think there's a few questions on it. Sorry, I missed one. I think uh, someone asked earlier, what's my favorite or least favorite thing about traveling? It's dev I hate flying, so I hate the tra the travel aspect. The swag jackets. The jacket game is strong. With yeah, that young man. It is. Shout out to Joey, one of my favorite poker people in the poker world. Aces for Christy here. More vino, Darren says. Anastasia. Oh, Anastasia puts in the three bets. This is going to get interesting. Anastasia took a little break, came back firing. Christy's love and life. Ooh. <laughs> Three bet into aces. I don't know. <laughs> okay, hold on. I have an idea. And there's the four bet to 400. Anastasia <laughs> says, well. Your a7 shrinks up yeah. quite a bit facing yeah, a four dangerous. bet. That's dangerous looking. She has position. Let's see yeah. what she decides to do. Correctly lets it go. Nice hand, Christy. Mm -hmm. Which will include Rhonda, Juan, Caitlin, Liz, a, who is a dealer here, and... We can't do it? No, there is no bomb. They can't do bomb. You can't do four card. Great person, and also the Princess of Epip, Nakia, will also be on the felt tomorrow, 3 p.m. Central. Tune in for another great lady stream tomorrow. Cowboys for Esther, three bets to 175. Laura with big slick suited, going to go nowhere. Let's see what Anastasia does here with a seven suited. All three of these ladies still with their knit buttons. Let's see what Laura, Laura does. Here comes the four bet to 600. Quick, quick call from Esther. See, this is what I'm talking about. This is like the action you want to see with the knit <laughs> buttons. And there's the ace. Esther now needs some help, a king or a queen. And Esther's going to fire out there a thousand with her kings.
top, top. Lara, she's going to make the call. To the river we go. King or a queen does not come. Seven of hearts doesn't change anything. It goes check, check, and a $4,000 pot and her knit button is gone. Laura's going to take down that one. Talk a little bit about uh, next between the next hand about your involvement with the WPA. Yeah, the Women's Poker Association has been around for a while, and we just kind of try to advocate to get more women in the game. So, you know, to even their, check out their Facebook if you're a female watching and you're not already a part of the WPA. Laura picks up pocket kings here. So it's just a way for you to get involved, get connected, and having ladies' events is not to, you know, segregate women and men in poker. It's to funnel more women in that might not otherwise feel comfortable to play right. in an open event. So that's the reason we have them, and um, it, it has brought ladies in. Yep. And, you know, it's a social thing. It's fun, and, you know, it gets them more comfortable to play in uh, live settings because it can be very intimidating for a woman.